To thank those who have served, Hospice of the Western Reserve conducts both private and public veteran recognition ceremonies. These range from intimate ceremonies involving a single hospice patient to large events. On average, the agency hosts more than 40 ceremonies a year, honoring and thanking thousands of veterans. Veteran recognition ceremonies provide honor, dignity, and recognition to veterans at the end of their lives. Family members and friends are often on hand during the event. The ceremonies include the Pledge of Allegiance, a prayer of thanks, the awarding of a veteran service flag pin, the singing of God Bless America, a reading of what is a veteran, and the presentation of a certificate of recognition followed by the pinning. Ceremonies are variable, but always special. Some are conducted at hospitals, some at homes, or senior living centers. You see people across all ends of life spectrum. Cousins, wives, grandchildren, friends. It can be very emotional. Sometimes I have difficulty getting through this all myself, to tell the truth. We did a recognition ceremony at a homeless shelter. It was humbling just seeing how happy those guys were. Afterward, every single one of them came up and shook my hand and said, thanks for coming. We didn't have ticker tape parades when I returned from Vietnam. I've seen such a turnaround these past years. I see people's minds changing. Veterans are not getting tired of being thanked for their service. I'm proud to be able to thank them. It's a real honor. Often this is the first time someone has thanked these brave men and women. Recognition ceremonies can be therapeutic and meaningful for everyone involved.